Ugh, man, man, you it's good that we're finally gonna fix our sleep schedule by going to bed nice and early. We've been needing that for a while now. Yeah, staying up till 2am every night was pretty fun, but we can't afford to do it anymore. It's not fun to wake up at noon. Yep, you said it, Manuel. Anyways, can you go turn off the light, please? Alright, I got it. Alright, and off. I love being extra for no reason. <laughs> so, Luigi, you ready to finally wake up before everybody else? Oh, yeah, man, that's gonna be awesome, but, uh, I don't really know if I'm ready to go to sleep yet, though. I mean, what if the boogeyman tries to get me? The boogeyman? Well, yeah, I mean, what if he breaks in here while we're sleeping and he tries to steal my socks? Luigi, that's stupid. Go to sleep. Well, I'm just saying it. <sighs> you know what? Never mind, Medya. But when the boogeyman gets you, don't come crying to me. I'm just gonna get some sleep. <sighs> Getting some breakfast. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh my god! <laughs> what the heck? What was that? Was that the boogeyman? You know what? No, never mind. It's not the boogeyman. I'm just saying stupid stuff. I guess Maddie was right. Ha, ah, good morning, Maddie. Maddie? Maddie? Where'd he go? I thought he was next to me. <gasps> Wait a minute. He must have woken up before me. Aw, oh, man, I wanted to wake up before him. But I guess I'll get him someday. I'm just gonna go make me some breakfast so I can start the day off right. <laughs> oh, hey, Matthew, there you are. Uh, I don't know why you're sleeping on the floor, but... <gasps> Wait a minute. This means that I technically did wake up first because he's still asleep and I'm not. Oh, yes, this is another victory for Luigi. Oh, yeah, now that I have another win to my name, I'm just gonna make me some nice breakfast. <laughs> breakfast for the champ. Ugh, man, that was a good breakfast. Had I time to go back upstairs? Oh, I got so many things planned for today. Uh, huh? Hmm, you know, now that I think about it, something about this isn't normal. I mean, I'm a heavy sleeper, but I've never seen it to this extent. Madio? Madio? Why isn't he waking up? Hello? Uh, something must be wrong. I have to go ask others about this. Come with me, Madio. Uh, hey Bowser, can you help me out with something? Are you sure, Luigi? What's up? Aw, oh, come on, Luigi. I wanted to be the one that killed Mario. Bowser, I didn't kill Mario, but I can't seem to figure out why he won't wake up. Are you sure he's not dead? Well, no, no, no. He's not dead, Bowser. Don't say that. It's just I've tried everything to get him to wake up. I mean, I've tried yelling his name and moving him around, and he just won't budge. Hmm. Why don't you just try hitting him to death till he wakes up? Well, Bowser, how is that supposed to help? Why would I hit Mario? I don't know. That's the only idea I have. I guess thanks for the advice, Bowser. Well, of course, Luigi can always count on me. Oh, I can't wait to see what my controller will look like once I color it green. Oh, it's gonna look so cool. Uh, Junior, I need your help with some... What are you doing? Huh? Oh, hey, Luigi, I'm just trying to give my controller a fresh new skin. Do you think it'll look good in the color green? Uh, Junior, I hope you know that that's not how you do that. But anyways, Junior, can you help with Maddio? He won't answer anything I say no matter how much I try. Hmm, I don't know. He looks pretty dead to me. Well, no, he's not dead, Junior. Don't say that. I just can't seem to figure out why he won't react to literally anything. Hey, Maddio! Mario, hello? You see what I mean? Hmm, yes I do admit, this is quite a peculiar case, but I think I have the solution to all this. Luigi, he's probably just in a deep sleep, you're overthinking this. A deep sleep? Well, no, Junior, there's no way! Trust me, me and Mario are known for being deep sleepers, but there's always something that makes us wake up. Yeah, I guess that's true. Well, I don't know, just try playing a song he really hates or something, that would make me wake up for sure. <gasps> Good thinking, Junior, use that as a backup plan. Thanks for the advice. Oh god, I need more advice than that, where am I gonna get more advice? Oh, wait, why would you need more advice? I just gave you some- Alright then, have fun making things more complicated. Oh man, I don't have any good advice. Who am I supposed to ask? <gasps> Yoshi. I can ask Yoshi for advice. <laughs> okay, Yoshi, I really need your help, okay? For some reason, Mario just won't wake up, and I don't know why, okay? Do you know what's going on? Luigi's dead. What, dead? Why does everyone keep saying that? There's no way Mario can be dead. Yeah, now that you say that, Yoshi, that makes a lot more sense. That's exactly what I was trying to tell you. Uh, no, you guys are all wrong. I'll prove it. We'll take Mario to the hospital, and there we'll find out if he's dead, okay? Now let's get in the car.
So, Doctor, what's going on? Well, you see, the good side of things is that since Mario obviously has a pulse, we know that he's still alive. Yes, I know it! See, guys, I told you Mad was wasn't dead. I told you so. Hey, you can't blame us for making assumptions. I mean, he looked just like Dad's grandpa when he was laying in that casket. Junior, what made you think that was appropriate to say? Wait, so what does this mean for Maddio then? Well, let's see. He has a pulse, but he doesn't show much brain activity, and he can't move, so he might be in a deep coma of some sort. <gasps> Wait, what? Yeah, I was kind of expecting that. So, is there anything we can do? Like, is there a way to snap him out? Well, unfortunately, there isn't much we can do besides just wait for him to wake up, which could be at any time. I mean, it could be now or 50 years down the line. You never really know. Well, I can wait 50 years without my brother! Maddio, if you can hear me so Somewhere in there, please keep fighting, bro. I know you can do this. Hello? Uh, hello? Uh, what's going on? This is really weird. What am I doing at the hospital with all my friends? Luigi, Junior, Yoshi, Bowser, they're all here, but why? <gasps> Wait a minute. Maybe they're throwing me a surprise birthday party. Wait, my birthday isn't until May. Hey, I know you guys can hear me. Hello? Ugh, screw this. I'm just gonna go get a Twinkie. Wait, what? Why can't I move? What the heck is going on? Huh? Hey guys, I'm getting some brain activity from Mario. Wait, really? Oh, that's good. Well, what are we supposed to do now? I mean, you're free to take him home. Just make sure to watch after him and feed him well. That's all I suggest. He should be fine. Huh, well, okay. Come on, Mario. Wait, why are you dragging me? Let me go! Uh, hello? Can you guys actually not hear me? I mean, I can see and hear you guys. All right, guys, now that we got Maddio tucked in the bed, you think it's time to get some Shed-Eye? Luigi, do you actually not remember that time that you yourself had a coma? Why are you so worried about Mario? Well, because, Junior, who knows when he's gonna wake up? Wait, wake up? What do you mean, wake up? I'm right here! I mean, you woke up from your coma within less than 24 hours, so who's to say Mario can't either? Huh, I guess that could be true. What the hell are you guys talking about? All right, guys, you ready to get some sleep? It's been a really stressful day. Yeah, we just gotta wish for the best in the morning. All right, let's go, guys. Good night, Luigi. All right, good night, guys. Sleep tight. All right, man, you'll see you tomorrow morning. Hopefully, you'll be okay. Wh what? Good night, brother. Uh, so, I guess I'm actually in a coma? And not even one of those good comas where you get to sleep forever? Oh, man, this is gonna be so boring. I can see and hear everything, but I can't do anything. This sucks. Well, at least this made me realize one thing. This is gonna be a lot harder than I thought. <laughs> what the heck is that? Oh, it's just Maddio's stupid alarm. <gasps> Wait a minute! Maddio! Oh, I gotta go check on him. I gotta see if he's woken up. Yeah. Oh, man, that was a pretty good sleep. You know, I'm starting to kind of like this whole coma thing. You know, I can just sit back, relax for as long as I want, nobody to bother me. Hey, Maddio! Maddio! How you doing? <sighs> Never mind. Uh, hey, Maddio, how you doing? I came as soon as I woke up. M Maddio? Oh, man, you're still not awake. I thought you would have been out of that coma by now. It's been over a day. Oh, what am I supposed to do? I mean, there's not really anything you can do. You kind of just have to wait for me to wake up or something. <gasps> oh, I know. I just got to spend as much time as I possibly can with you. And since we have such a good brotherly bond, maybe it'll cause you to snap out of your coma. L Luigi, I don't think that's how science works. Ugh, all right, man. Yo, how many think of something we can do? Hmm. Please be the TV. Please be the TV. Please be the TV. <gasps> I know. How about I tell you my whole life story from start to finish, every single detail. Okay, I doubt that you actually remember your whole life story with every detail. But no, Luigi, that's gonna take forever. That's gonna take like hours, probably days. I'm gonna take that silence as a yes. All right. So it all started years back at the hospital. Our parents were there, and so were the doctors. Uh, oh my God, he's actually doing it. I thought he wasn't gonna do it. <sighs> oh well. I mean, this isn't really gonna be that interesting, but. It shouldn't take too long. And then you got in that coma, and that's where the story ends. Or well, at least where it's supposed to continue. I can't predict the future, so I can't say anything about that. So, Maddio, what did you think? Pretty cool story, huh? Yeah, emphasis on the word story. Luigi, you literally made up most of that. Like, how does it make sense that you were the Prime Minister of England when we live in America? All right, well, until I come up with the next thing we can do, I'm just gonna go downstairs and make me some lunch. Or probably dinner, I don't know. That story took up, like, all afternoon. God, I can't believe how long that story was. Oh, great. Luigi mentioned lunch, and now I'm hungry. How am I even supposed to eat during a coma? Oh, be quiet, stomach. I'm going to the kitchen to get some food, okay? Be patient. Hey, be quiet, stomach, okay? 
Wait a minute, that wasn't my stomach that time. <gasps> Wait a minute! Uh, oh my god, but Matthew, that's you! Oh, I can't believe it. He hasn't eaten food in over a day. Well, don't worry, Matthew. I'll go get you some food from the kitchen, okay? Uh, oh, wow, Luigi's actually getting me food? Oh, well, that's nice. I guess that makes up for the eight-hour-long story. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got in the fridge. Ugh. All right, let's see. Mm. <gasps> a chicken tender! Oh, Matthew's gonna love this. He loves chicken tenders. All right, Matthew, here is your specially prepared chicken tender. I hope you enjoy. And now it's time to go make my food. I swear his IQ drops by the minute. Hmm, hot I wonder what I'm gonna eat today. I guess I could order some Subway, but I don't know how much money I have on me. <sighs> God, I gotta stop waking up late. Well, oh, hey, Luigi, what are you doing? <gasps> oh, good morning, Junior. Or good afternoon. I'm just going downstairs to make some food. Do you want some? Oh, sure, I'll take some food. Thanks for the offer, Luigi. Alrighty, I'll go get started on it right now. Sweet, oh, this is gonna be awesome. I'll just go watch some TV while I wait. <laughs> well, oh, hey, Mario, I didn't expect to see you here, and, uh, chicken tender? Uh, what is this chicken tender doing here? I mean, it's not mine, it's definitely not yours, so... Wait a minute, it's probably Luigi's. I should go ask him about this. Uh, hey, Luigi, I think you left the chicken tender on the bed. Are you sure that's not part of the food you're making? Uh, no, we don't have any more chicken tenders. I just made the last one for... <gasps> oh, you're thinking of Matthew's chicken tender. Oh, yeah, don't touch that. I made that for him. You mean the guy who literally can't move? Wh <gasps> oh, yeah, I forgot. He can't eat on his own. Man, this is gonna take a lot of adjusting to do. Thanks for reminding me, Junior. I'll go fix that right now. Uh, all right, you're welcome, Luigi. Well, I guess I'm gonna go make my own food then. Uh, all right, Matthew. So I probably should have realized that you can't eat on your own, so sorry about that. That was my bad. But how am I supposed to get you to eat? I mean, I can't just let you sit there and eat nothing. What do I do? <gasps> Wait. I don't know if this will work, but it's worth a shot. Wh what? All right, man, you have got the solution to all of our problems, so here you go. W what? What is this guy even trying to do? Uh, I hope this is working. I don't know how long I have to stand here for, though. Hey, Luigi, what's the Wi-Fi password? I think Bowser changed it. Luigi, what are you doing? Oh, hey, Yoshi, I'm just trying to feed Matthew. He's really hungry. And how exactly are you doing that? Oh, well, I'm just using this piece of paper. This one's got a cheeseburger on it, so I know he's loving this. It's his favorite food. Okay, I'll ask my question again. How exactly is this feeding him? What do you mean? It's just feeding him. Didn't you pay attention in science class? Wh what? Luigi, what does science class have to do with this? Oh my gosh, Yoshi, you really forgot about photosynthesis? You're so silly. You're trying to use photosynthesis on a person? But yeah, why? I mean, it works for plants. Why wouldn't it work for him? <sighs> Luigi, I'm not even going to explain why this is stupid. I'm just going to leave before my brain rots. I'll see you later. Okay, then. Bye, Yoshi. Man, why was he being so weird? Oh, hold on, Matthew, the phone's ringing. A uh, call from the hospital? What do they need? Eh, maybe it's important. Maybe it's about Matthew. All right, uh, hello? Whoa, uh, hey, Luigi. So, basically, the reason I'm calling is because we kind of made a really big mistake. We forgot to give you the necessary materials to feed Mario. Oh, no, no, that's okay. I'm figuring out ways to feed him right now using photosynthesis. My friends aren't very supportive of it, though. Uh, yeah, I can see why. Anyways, no, that's not how you feed him. See, you're supposed to use an IV tube connected to a machine, which will transfer nutrients into his body. Uh, I don't know what any of that means. <sighs> the IV tube is what feeds him. We need to deliver it to your house. We're just letting you know in advance so it doesn't come off as a surprise. Wait, my ID feeds him? Sir, I barely even used my ID. I got it so long ago. Why would that thing feed him? W what the? <sighs> no, I said IV. You know what? It'll be delivered to your house tomorrow. It'll come with instructions so your hollow brain will know what to do with it. Wait, but I already have my ID. Why are you giving me another one? You're a moron. W what? Uh, hello? Oh man, he hung up on me. But he said something about delivering something to the house, so I guess I have to wait till that thing delivers. Hope it won't be too long. Huh? Who's at the door? <sighs> hello? Hello? Who's at the door? Oh, there's a box here. Wait, what does it say? Sorry, we couldn't find a spare IV tube, but this device will still feed him. Okay, if you say so. Hmm, I wonder what's in this box. Let's see. Yeah. What the heck is this thing? Like, like, how does it even work? I don't get it. Wait a minute, maybe that part's supposed to go around the space. Alright, Matthew, I guess it's time to feed you. Alright, I think I've got it all set up now. Now all I have to do is just press this button. Wow, the thing just fed him like that? This thing's pretty cool. Well, Matthew, I hope you enjoyed your meal. I'm just gonna go to the bathroom really quick. And the three little pigs lived happily ever after. The end. W what? Matthew! Matthew, where'd you go? I thought we were playing hide and seek. Oh, you're so good at this game. Hey, Matthew, catch! Ah. 
Oh, thank God that didn't hit me. Why didn't you catch it? Hey, Matthew, look at this. So the packaging gets some really weird bubble wrap in it. But you know what we do to bubble wrap. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I don't know how much longer I can take this. <laughs> I mean, at first I thought it'd be okay, you know? I get to see my brother every day, but I just hate seeing someone who was so filled with life be restricted to this. Oh my god, somewhere in there, Matthew's just begging to come out. I'd do anything just to get my brother back. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. But how? <gasps> oh, I know. I just gotta call the doctor and see if he has any advice. I mean, he's the one that knows a lot about coma, so maybe he knows. Alright, you just gotta hope he answers. Don't worry, man. I'll get you out of this. Huh? A call from Luigi? Let's see what it is. Uh, hello, this is your doctor speaking. Oh, hey, doctor. So basically, it's been a couple weeks since Maggio first went into his coma, and he still hasn't woken up, but I'm getting really sick of it. So do you have any advice on how to wake him up? W wow, I didn't know Luigi wanted me out of the coma this much. I mean, I want to be out of it too, but jeez, I really got to try something. He's going to go crazy. So what should I do? Mm. <gasps> oh, I know. I just got to see if I can force myself to move. <sighs> God, it's so hard to do. Wait, I just kind of felt a muscle, though. <gasps> Wait, I think I have some feeling. Uh, well, I was thinking you should try some Adderall. I don't know. I've never used it before. <sighs> oh, my God. I'm uh, moving a little bit. Uh, 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 <sighs> the heck was that? Oh my god! Uh, hey, doctor, I'm gonna have to call you back later. Oh my god, Matthew! Oh my god, Matthew! Are you okay? How did you fall? Wait a minute, you couldn't have fell. You weren't that close to the end of the bed. So that means... Oh my god! He just fell on his own! He fell on purpose! Oh my god, that means there's still some life in him! I have to get the others! <sighs> Jeez, I took up all my energy. Well, I hope Luigi finds some kind of a solution. Okay, guys, now I know it's gonna sound strange, but I need you to hear me out, okay? So while I was at a phone call, Matteo, who wasn't even close to the edge of the bed, somehow found himself on the floor. I mean, someone who's basically paralyzed shouldn't fall off a bed, right? Yeah, I mean, he was sitting pretty close to the edge of the bed. It could have happened naturally. Yeah, but he wasn't that close, so maybe it could mean something. Something a lot deeper than we thought. Have any of you guys seen my Game Boy? I lost it last week. Look, guys, if I'm being completely honest, it kind of seems like a sign of Maggio wanting to break free, and we gotta be the ones to help him with that. So how are we gonna do it? Do you guys have any ideas? Mm, no, not off the top of my head. Yeah, I feel like we've already tried a lot of ideas. It's gonna be hard to come up with something original. Hmm, okay. Bowser, do you have any ideas? I mean, does he know where my Game Boy is? <sighs> Never mind. <gasps> Wait a minute, I just came up with something. All right, Maggio, you're coming to the stairs. Wait, what? Why are you going to the stairs, Luigi? What are you doing? All right, Maggio, are you ready for takeoff? N no, not really. This seems like a terrible idea. Uh, Luigi, I don't think this is a very smart idea on how to get Mario out of his coma. I mean, usually this is how people go into comas, not out of them. But wait, really? Oh, yeah, I guess I can see why. Well, what am I supposed to do then? I mean, I have a few ideas. <laughs> Well, guys, it looks like none of those things worked. I don't know what we're gonna do to get Maddio out of this. Well, wait a minute. I just realized we haven't done the most obvious solution. Why don't we just play a bunch of loud sounds into his ear and see if that does anything? Hmm. You know, I guess that could be worth a shot. W what? No, it's not. It's just gonna irritate me a bunch, and there's nothing I can do about it. Well, I guess it's time to play some sounds, so I'll go first. All right, let's hope this works. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Nothing? Nothing at all? All right, Bowser, I guess you try to play a loud sound. Okay, this one has to work. Ugh. Oh, come on, Mario, you're still not waking up. This is the most annoying thing ever. Hmm, let me see. I think I have an idea. All right, let me just press play. Oh, this one is so funny. Mario, how are you not laughing at this? It's so fun. <laughs> Seriously? How is this not working? Guys, I don't think this is working. I think we just gotta give up on this plan. But what are we gonna do? 
Wait a minute, speaking of sounds... I don't know, just try playing a song he really hates or something. That would make me wake up for sure. Junior, give me the phone. I have one more sound that we can play. Alright, guys, if this doesn't work, then I don't know what will. Alright, let me just press play. <laughs> oh my god! Jesus, what was that? Wait, wait Matthew, are you back? Uh, yeah, I guess so. I mean, my legs can move, my arms can move, I guess I'm good to go. Well, wait, how did that happen with that song? I don't know, I guess my cringe levels just raised so high that my body couldn't take it. Well, anyways, at least I'm back. Huh, well, that's cool. Alright, we're gonna go to bed, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Alright, see you guys! Well, Matthew, now that you're finally back, what's the first thing that we should do? Eh, I don't know. I say we just sleep it off and figure it out in the morning. S -s sleep it off? Uh, Matthew, are you sure? I mean, what if the boogeyman comes in?